Hi, P Monday. What blast all? Welcome to the stream. How is everyone? Tonight, let's play Pokemon. Let's play some Pokemon. My OBS has crashed at the start of my stream for two for two streams in a row already. I have no idea why is this why this is the case. <clears throat> but well, this is the case. Right, anyway, let's have a little story update. We whoop the Elite Force S. We beat the we cleared Elite Four, we We bet we also cleared uh, our path of the Titans. Yeah we went to the we went to the we went to the lab. We went to Professor Turo's lab. We went to Professor Turo's lab, uh, we <coughs> Yeah and then we have been enlisted to go into Area Zero but but then we are told we need to get some extra hands on deck first. So today we are going to have some major fights. We are going to fight uh We are go we are going to fight this one. We are going to confront Cassopia. We are also going to fight Nemona. Nemona is our last. Of course we have we have already fought the champion, but then now we are left in Nemona. This is a special one, isn't it? One moment. Tour. What type of is this? A ice? Ice stereotype. Ice stereotype. Okay, let's go. Hi, Suki. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Although Christmas is over. Oh yeah, Merry Christmas. We are about to move on to the next festival, which is Tong Tong Chiang. Chinese New Year is coming! Eh, hey, wait, what's that? Is this rock? I thought it was ice. It's not ice, it's rock. Well, okay, that, that, makes, that makes life a lot easier. It's time to wave crash. Was the recoil damage this high? Oh my god, okay, okay. Hi Mary, good DM, God blast. Go, yeah. <coughs> I need a, wait, I, I need a quad jet like this. I need a quad jet. I need a quad jet. I, at, at least until the shield breaks. At least until the shield breaks. I don't know why. Wait, was the record damage so high? Anyway, how was your Monday? How's your Monday? How's your Monday? How's your Christmas weekend? <coughs> nice. Down. Anyway, last night, last yesterday night, uh, I was, I was supposed to meet my friend for a gym session, <coughs> but uh, my my friend came down with a fever, so I went alone. <coughs> I kind of got used to, yeah, I, I cycled to the gym. Anyway, I cycled to the gym there, and well, uh, hmm, let's see, let's see. 
Have I complained to you that my bicycle brakes are very noisy? But I've decided to like embrace it and live with it. So that means I become one of those selfish pricks that go around without go around with like noisy bikes and all. My my bicycle brakes are abs absurdly like loud. I do for some reason. Like they just how should I put this? How should I put this? Like it makes loud screeching noises, especially the front. The real one does make noise, but especially the front. The front one is especially loud. Sounds like about the isekai summer. Oh, by the way, you know this. You know this Pokemon and the flying, right? I am told there is a glitch involving this. I mean, I mean, yet another glitch, right? Yet another glitch from Scarlet Violet, right? But yes, I'm, I'm being told there's another glitch. One moment, let me let, let me clear this one out first, okay? Okay, come, yeah, Big Mama will clear this out first and then after that I will show you. I will try, I will try to replicate this. My cause my friend who told me about this glitch told me that he has he has not been able to successfully replicate it in the way that the video did. After this terror raid, we're gonna try we're gonna try this glitch. Everyone, please note that. Please note that uh, if you attempt to replicate this, please note that I will not be responsible for the loss of your save file or any potential damage that comes uh, that, that, that may come as a result of attempting what I do. Yeah, I thought this this is an obligatory disclaimer. Yeah, so uh, there you go. I told you this already. I told you straight out already. Yeah. Do I still get a reward so yes I still get an item so that's good. Okay, so wait uh let, let me find the link. Find that link that my friend sent me. <laughs> okay. This is the one. Give me a moment ah. Uh. I'm trying to load out the details. Yeah, anyway, this is a this is a something like a speed glitch, apparently. Yeah, let me pull out the instructions on the side. This is the like a gliding acceleration bug or something something to that effect. First, I am being told to f go to a very high place. I know there's this place that's very high, perfect for for this. Which way ah? Down this cliff, right? Yeah, down this cliff. Or should we go? Let's set this as a let's set this as a destination. Okay. Then you see the cliff up there, we are gonna fly there. Fly from there. Okay, let's go to a high place. How do you go for that? Oh yeah, by the way, if I sound, if you all find that I sound kinda sleepy, it's cause I I nap two hours. I nap two hours and I, and I'm and I'm still in a bit of a who am I, what am I, where am I state. But by the end of this stream, I will be wide awake. 
And yeah, I don't know how I'm gonna sleep tonight. And yeah, we will try, yeah, we will try. Okay. This should be high enough. I don't know. It hey, was this Terra right here. It's a sand down. I I heard that there there are like some there's some deliberate uh, rates right now. You can you can hit a deliberate rates to farm a considerable number of items. Hi Capsize, welcome to the stream. I, I was, yeah, everyone here, I, I was recently tipped off about this potential, uh, unexpected feature, yes, unexpected feature. So, what we need to do, it tells me here, this thing tells me here, go to high places, immediately after gliding while dashing, press B to cancel glide. Tap B repeatedly while tilting the stick left and or right about 90 degrees. How's this work? Can we go higher? Oh wait, I need to dash right, I need to dash right, so I need, I need a bit of a runway to dash. Ah, wait, wait, wait. Immediately after gliding or dashing, press B to cancel glide. Is this even working? How do I know if it's working or not? <laughs> Wouldn't gliding be faster? No, the thing is this, this dude was flying through the air. Yeah, wait, that means I didn't do this, I didn't do this successfully. In the video, I saw the dude is flying through the air. Does this mean I need to run all the way up again? Hang on, let me try to find a way where I can get to a higher place much more easily. Yeah? Yeah? Ah, no, whoops, bad. I have no idea if I'm doing correctly or not. No, I'm landing though. Am I supposed to keep doing this in the air? Hmm. Okay, try this one more time. Regardless of how it works out, uh, I'm going to continue. We are going to fight Nemona. I'm going to fight Nemona. I'm going to fight a uh, Cassopia. Cassopia open quotation mark, close quotation mark. I feel like I'm destroying my, my controller doing this.
Nope, I'm still gliding down. Bloop. You look similar to COVID 9 in air. Why not Tinkerton sh shooting you down? Hoi! Why do you want the Tinkerton to shoot me down? You shoot me down, but I won't fall. <laughs> you shoot me down, but I won't fall because I'm titanium. Yeah. I'm titanium. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> I think let's Before we go and fight Nemona, there's a Terra Raid there It's glowing, it's gl glowing so and which leads me to believe that this is actually the Special Deliberate Raid If you are playing Scarlet Violet, there are special deliberate raids. I'm actually told that I'm actually told that uh this raid is actually supposed to end already. Like Or rather or, or rather uh it would have ended because it's it's the 26 for me. But I think the time zone is being set to like American time or something. Or hill time zone differences, it means I have extra time. To hit the rates. Oh my god, wow. Look at that look at that crazy drift. Shit! <laughs> Isn't it cool? Drift! Drifting like this reminds me of the Mario Kart I played yesterday. I actually earned some rank points, can you believe it? Either I got lucky, either I got lucky or I actually got a little better at Mario Kart. I understand. What do you understand, trainer? I understand here in this freezing land, I finally come to understand a great truth. We have not reached a common understanding. Yes, you made, me, you made me understand it all too well. At least don't mind arresting me. For? Ah, 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 chew! Oh, that's my friend yesterday. He fell sick. And could not come to a gym session. Oh, this is a psychic terror shot. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? We are. Also, you're telling me this Pokemon Center was nearer. It's literally a straight line, and then I went to take the, the long way up. Okay, challenge alone. Huh? 
Wait, what's that? Steel? Is that steel? Is this a steel teratite? Okay, yeah, I think it is. No problem. One shot, one kill. Deadly Bird doesn't have an evolution, right? Even in this gen. Is there? Yeah, no ever. Oh, okay. I was hoping you get one. You know, so that it's a little... So they can actually have some use from it. Like, like they gave far, they gave far fetch an Evo in Sword and Shield. Maybe on future jet. Ah, future! I celebrate a future gen. Ah, must I really wait a future gen? Deadly Bird came out in gold and silver, you know. Actually, now that I think of it, a lot of the gold and silver Pokemon got, got this kind of evo. Uh, like, yeah, like Dance Pass. Dance Pass. Wordia. Quillfish also got. Quillfish got an evo. Legends are serious. Has, have any of you used like that da, da, like done spas anyway? Yeah, good luck. Like, I spinner you. <clears throat> Please sign here. Had to be the region variant forever, huh? Region? Like, like that means you catch it in the game or something. You catch it in the game and then evolve it in the same game, right? That is just Wooper this time. Oh yeah, Wooper also have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, oh, I literally had a Cloud Sire here. Last ten, last gen Obstagoon and Corsola. Oh yes, Cos Corsola. Oh yeah, Corsola. Yeah, yeah, Corsola also. Corsola, another one that there was, they really needed some, uh, yeah, a, a little boost. Where is the town? Everyone, let's fight Nemona. Let's okay. Let's let's confront Cassiopeia first. Now, who do you think Cassiopeia is? I think I already have an idea. Throughout the, this whole Team Star like arc, there has been just one other person who has always shown his face, but has otherwise not really made themselves like. Known? Yeah. 
It's a ma magazine enti entitled Old Culture. It's the June issue. Do you want to read it? An article caught your eye. Animal of How Dear, file number 6, Iron Thorns, a Tyranita of the Distant Future. A strange being called Iron Thorns has been sighted in a certain cave in Paldia. This being bears a strong resemblance to Tyranita, but it apparently displays great cool headedness and prefers to avoid unnecessary fights. It appears to be highly intelligent and clad in met metallic armor, causing some to speculate that it may be a Tyranita as it will appear a billion years from now. Its name comes from a similarly described entity that appears in the Violet Book. Oh, there's another one here. I didn't know you could go up the second floor, by the way. And capsize has made flying around convenient. So many Pokemon centers. Yeah, it's it's bad. I it's not. It, it can It really feels like going on a road trip, which is nice. Like it feels like you're riding on a, on a motorbike, on a motorcycle, and then you're, you're stopping at various like, pit stops along the way. In fact, in fact, they even kind of look like, like gas stations. The Pokemon centers even kind of look like drive drive through gas stations. Rather rather than like yeah, a conventional Pokemon center. Oh my god, camera. There's a book entitled How to Become a Champion. Do you want to read it? For Pokemon trainers who are out to grow stronger and wiser, there's no higher calling than becoming a champion. To reach that lofty rank, you must pass a test administered at Paldia's official Pokemon League headquarters. In Paldia, anyone and in fact any number of people can become a champion, regardless of factors like age. That means you can too, as long as you've got the strength and the wisdom to set a leadership example for your fellow trainers. Your path to becoming a champion lies in the Pokemon genes throughout Paldia. Once you've defeated the eight gym leaders in battle and earned their gym badges, we look forward to it. Your knock on the Pokemon League's door. Now, see here, I am the champion already. Oh my god, is that a third floor? Oh, there is a third floor. And Caps are, uh, it says, is this the only explorable building except your house? I don't think so, but there are drastically lesser buildings to explore, yes. There aren't many more after. There aren't many more. Aside from what you, you have listed. Oh, this is Old Culture August. Animal of Paldia, file number 8. Iron Moth, a UFO sent to spy on humankind. The name Iron Moth was borrowed from that of a flying object described in the era defining Violet Book. It was said to resemble Volcano Rona and would descend from the sky, following people around and occasionally even attacking them. At some point, the Iron Moth's aggression is a sign that it is in fact an UFO of sorts being controlled by alien life. Perhaps something out there is using Iron Moth to con observe us, waiting for the moment to mount an invasion. Okay. By the way, ah, uh, how do I find this Cassopia? Oh. oh right, I forgot this was a thing. <laughs> you can explore the different parts of the school. It's like it's like they remove all the all the other buildings so they could ex explore purely your school. This is our dorm room that we have not seen since the start of the game. How do you like it? It's a very cozy looking dorm room. I want an L-shaped table. I want an L-shaped table in a corner room like this. Not gonna lie. Okay, what's in the school store? Oh, is this a Pokemon Mart? Irashai!
<coughs> oh, this is some bread. This is some bread section. Okay. <coughs> Cafeteria. We can go there later. This is the biology lab. We can actually go and talk to our senses. Jack. Ah, hello, hello. Have you gotten used to things here at the Academy Shiraka? Have you been using a Pokédex app? I'm, uh, <laughs> I'm the one who made it, you know. Every once someone using the app catches a Pokémon, that data gets sent to me. It's really helping in my Pokémon research. Eh? So be sure to catch any new Pokémon you find and work on filling in your Pokédex. For your first goal, let's aim for say 30. Register 30 Pokemon in your app. Do I get anything? Oh. <laughs> this is the original prof? Uh, no, no. The original professor is someone called Turo, I think. Yeah. But actually, there isn't really a clearly defined professor, because the, car the, the this professor kind of addresses you most mainly by vi video link. Video link on your phone. Mostly at the start of the game, you meet up with the. At the start of the game, you meet up with uh. Your, your school principal. So he's kind of the one showing you the ropes instead. But he knows the prof the professor. And so now, so so yeah, in, for this part, the school is the one handling most of it. Yeah. But the the, prof the professor is a little less clearly defined compared to previous titles. But but it, yeah, the the professor is Turo, who mostly addresses us via video call. <clears throat> so anyway, our next target is to catch 200 Pokemon. I didn't know you could do. You you had all these kind, of, all these little things to do. Four swipe, uh, leaves the op the op opposing target with one HP. It is very useful to catch Pokemon. Hester, why if he is a Shiraga? I have a question for you. Do you find my class difficult? Quite. Hmm, perhaps I need to improve how I convey the material. So, Shiraga, you chose to take on gyms as part of your treasure hunt. That must mean you like Pokemon better, is that correct? Uh, well, I guess yes. One naturally becomes skilled at doing what they enjoy. That must be why you are so strong. Ah, do forgive me for springing such an odd question upon you so suddenly. I often find myself pondering the nature of strength these days. Anyway, thank you again for your input, Shiraka. You became slightly closer with Mr. Hessel. Why is there a closeness stat? What is this? When we reach the maximum closeness, do we unlock some ending? Happy ending. It's like those visual novels, you know, you must you must increase you must increase like the closeness, the friendship. Okay. It's a home icon room. <laughs> Is this persona a harvest moon? I have not played persona before, but but yes, I know harvest moon. I haven't finished it though, I only played I only played a little bit. My activities, indeed, people, 
From all of what I've been talking about, how strong of a battler you are and the amazing Pokemon you take along with you. You are quite the object of everyone's interest, though I imagine that may be a bother for you. The home economics classroom is something of a place of rest for the academy student, you see. Here they delight in sharing the latest gossip and the like while enjoying a light snack. You come up quite often in those talks recently, Master Shiraga, so much so that I find myself intrigued. We are winning the hearts of these teachers. Oh my god. Scandalous. Scandalous. Oh my, if it's a Shiraka, hello there! You perhaps have a question about class? What were you having trouble with? Let's have a little review here, shall we? When a rock type moves, it's a flying type move, what becomes of the move's damage? Uh, 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 uh. Double. Miss time, miss time! Uh, miss time, is it true you are a gym leader? That is indeed true, I'm trying a strong battler, you know. Her sister is the gym leader now. Rhyme, yeah. Actually, yeah, actually I do want to know how come you chose to quit. Oh, we aim, but we became closer. So one day she'll tell. So one day she'll she'll tell us why 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 she decide why she decided to like not be a gym leader anymore. Things of all or things that are new. Everyone, do you prefer new stuff or older things? I am torn because I like neither. The present is the most important. Really? What's this closeness thing do in the school? What does this do? What happens when, when, we, when we reach like max closeness? Oh my, you can even flirt with the school principal. Oh, are we going to conf- uh, Is this where we go to to confront like Cassopia? You see, I recently heard a word whose meaning escapes me. I believe it to be some form of slang. Tell me, what does... What does Chilgi mean? Huh? I don't know. What's this? I feel like I'm giving misleading info.
Was that even correct? <laughs> huh? Now you're asking me which 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 of the teachers here? It has to be you. Right, it has to be you. You. <laughs> Me! Are you quite sure? I suspect some element of diplomacy may be at work here, but if that is indeed how you feel, then I am most happy to hear it. We are truly blessed to have so many wonderful teachers and staff members at the UVA Academy. I firmly believe that our faculty is second to none in their commitment to our students' ongoing education and well-being. Thank you very much for sharing your thoughts, Master Shiraga. You can even closer with Director Clavel. Capsize says, Google, opposite or trendy. Oh, uh, sorry, Professor. Sorry, Principal. Okay, wait, but, but the, the, no, no, there's just one problem. Where? Just where is Cassiopeia? I've heard all kinds of rumors. Apparently, you fell off a cliff right after enrolling in the academy. And even picked a fight Team Star. Oh, yeah, you started a treasure hunting, right? Don't tell me about anything super interesting you find out there in your adventures. I'm just I'm kind of bored just sitting in here all day, you know. I don't have any classes to teach, and students only come here to skip class. So, yeah, drop by if you can. Deal, deal. Oh. To go on a fling the school nurse. Me, on the other hand, I actually wanted to become a teacher. I'm just a school nurse, you know, I can't teach classes or anything like that. I could not pass a certification exam to become an actual health teacher. I took it so many times, but no luck, so I'm here, I am stuck forever in the nurse's office. Oh, uh, sorry, I guess this, this isn't a very fun thing to talk about. But you're just such a good listener, I find myself telling you all kinds of stuff. I hope you'll still come see me even if I talk your ears off like this. You become even closer in Nurse Miriam. Here is a student skipping class. Entrance hall? You still have more to do with uh, the di director also. Shiraga- Oh! Kesopia! Thanks for coming. I got sp I got jump. I got fucking jump. I got sprung on. I know it's you already, Penny. The EV bag was a giveaway. Yeah. 
This must be quite the shock for you. The big boss, Kesopia, they were both me all along. When I saw you make quick work of those team star lackeys outside school that time, the idea for Operation Star Force suddenly came to me. My skills let me get hold of as much LP as I want, so I decided to use that to tempt you into helping me out. After the operation started, I kept an eye on you as a member of the supply unit and had you battle the bosses on my behalf. All for the goal of defeating me and putting an end to Team Star once and for all. But still, there's a part of me that wants Team Star to live on. I can't just roll over and let you win without putting up a fight. This is the final showdown. Are you ready? Ready for you. Sorry to keep you. The letter of apology missed time had me, uh, I mean, preparations took longer than I expected. That voice, are you Clive? Penny, so you are, you are, I mean, no, I mean, is that you, Cassiopeia? In the flesh, I have, I have a task for you, Clive, if you accept it. I want you to record what happens next, so I can send the video to Team Star. They need to see the outcome of this battle for themselves. Oh, okay, will do. We have our cameraman. Then allow me to introduce myself properly. I'm the big boss of Team Star. The name is Cassiopeia. No, Penny! Now bow down before the overwhelming might of Team Star's founder! Is this a full EV party? I won't hold back in this battle, I'll stay through the Team Star's code. I think this is a full EV party. <clears throat> nice, nice one you. Level 62, I just noticed. Level 62, okay we can do this. After this, let's switch out, yeah. Because my stats have dropped a little bit already. Jotion. Yeah, it's a good time to go. It's a good time to go. Jotion. Go, Choco. Jotion. Why are Pokemon have baby doll eyes? I win though. Vaporeon. Vaporeon, go! You know what throw? <laughs> My subtitle just change it to the unit. Like the kilowatt, like the unit. Kilowatt. Yeah, you just change it to your KW. Anyway, let's discharge. This one, I will stay in the field. However, I am going to vote switch out. Go, Melon Pan. Oh my god. Okay, crunch. Lifion. I'm going to Ice Fang you.
เอา้เอาเอาไอซ์เฟงโอเคดิสคันอะเตงกี้ because my attack has been reduced already no problem come out flamingo อ่ะอ่ะได้โอมายโอมายว่ามูสิ้นเดียวโอ้ this is gonna hurt it's going to hurt last one is Sylvion Sylvion okay I can't fault you on your battle skills at all. No wonder the bosses fell at your hands. Can I brave bird? Can I brave bird? The problem is. I have attack debuffs in place. Yeah, I got attack debuffs in place. I'm going to switch. I should switch. I'm going to switch now. Time to terrestrial light, shine bright like a starry sky, and become who you really want to be. Magical girl, Henshin! My VV power will crush you into stardust! Huh? Come again? Come again? Nice. Very nice. <gasps> it's all over now. It's finally over, guys. It's done. Yakomo yeah, reminds me of someone from Sun and Moon, by the way. Gus Guzma, was it? Bye bye guys. Thanks for everything. I hope they reunite and meet in person once and for all. Thanks for everything, Shiraga, and you too, Clive. 
I'm glad I could see this through the end. I guess this is it for Team Star and me too. Oh, that thought, Miss A A Penny. I'd like to check something with you first. Check what? What result is something you're Operation Star for if you're the big boss or Team Star? Wasn't there any other way to handle this? I tried telling the bosses that we were done once before, but they still didn't quit. Why not simply order them too? Our code states that no one in the team has a right to order people around. I could ask them all to do stuff, but I could never order them. So it's back to the code once again. The bosses must have taken it very seriously. They did. That's why I knew I could use it to force Team Star to disband. Because the bosses would do anything the code required of them, even leave the team. Yes, and according to the code, they had to accept any challenge made to them. That's the idea for Operation Star 4. Cassopia, let me ask you one last thing. What does Team Star- No, what do your friends in the team mean to you? They are... They are my greatest treasure. Splendid, thank you for apprising me of the situation, Miss Penny. What? Now, young lady, there's something I should very much like to discuss with you. Hey, quit it with the old geezer act, Clive, you're creeping me out. Indeed, well then, before we talk further, allow me to reveal to you my own secret identity. Ha <laughs> ha! Director Clavel! Yes, as Cassiopeia was a disguise, the boy you knew as Clive was mine. But, but why? I needed a way to talk with Team Star on equal terms. Students do tend to shy from speaking their mind to their teachers after all, much more so when faced with the director of the academy. Yeah, but where do I start? Wasn't the outfit a bit much? Plus I, plus I have some big feelings about that wig. Um, <laughs> well, that's quite enough of that for now. Everyone, why don't you come on out, huh? Everyone? Reunion? Reunion? Oh! Yo, big boss, long time no see. Momo. Well, like, long time no meet, right? I mean, we already found out your real name just now. Melly. Rarely is a long hidden countenance, a sight for sore eyes, my lady. Articles. So, um, I heard your real name's Penny. How have you been this whole time? Alti. We found you at last. You have no idea how worried we've been. Mary. Okay, gang, on the count of three. One, two. Hasta la vista, Kesopia. Hello, Penny. Oh... Now there, Miss Penny and each of you young bosses as well. On behalf of the Academy, I would, I would like to s I have something I would like to say to Team Star. You all have my sincerest apologies. C come again? As Director of the Academy, I let you down. My handling of your situation was a dismal failure. Well, I, I, I still- I, I mean, why? You all told me your, about your reasons for forming Team Star and about your subsequent actions. Ever since my first day as director, all I've ever experienced of the academy is an environment blessedly free of from bullying. But now I know that this piece was built on the back of your hurt and anger and of course, your immense courage in putting things to right. And so I'll get straight to the conclusion. The academy's order for Team Star to disband and my threat to expel those who did not obey are hereby revoked. Does that mean what I think it means? Indeed, Team Star can continue to exist, should that be your wish. Sorry for making you working, be worry, BB. We are all okay now. Oh, you, oh, you, you call me. You call Penny BB, that's so cute. Oh, 
poll and everyone have more to say. As previously stated, the requirement for Team Star to display has been revoked. Are we reaching the terms and conditions now? Your protracted truancy, your brazen customization of school uniforms, your unauthorized usage, usage of academic equipment, your reckless modification and Japanese driving of Pokemon powered vehicles. May I go on? Your flagrant disregard for school rules simply cannot be overlooked. Ah, time to pay the piper. Class as punishment, you all will be required to engage in community service. Community service? Yes, specifically, I will be asking you to manage the STCs. And that stands for the Star Training Centers. There should be facilities for cultivating Pokemon trainers' talents. I plan for the Academy to found them in collaboration with the Pokemon League. The idea came to me when I saw Master Shiraga battling his way through your bases. The bases construction, as well as the, as well as the battle tactics employed by the students in Team Star, are remarkably unique and creative. I will ask that you continue your team activities while henceforth as STC staff members using your formal bases as training facilities. And that is the sum of it. Does anyone have any concerns? Uh no. It sounds like fun, so I don't see how this will be anything but a win-win. So what do you say? You guys! Shiraka, what do you think? Of course it sounds great. Huh? But, but, um, I just... No need to give a response right this moment, Miss Penny. Do take some time to decide. For now, at least, I think our little group should go their separate ways. Not to say you should break up Team Star after all, I simply mean it's time to leave. Master Shiraga, please stop by my office later if you would. Let's go to the director's office. What's in here? Oh, there's a bathroom. <laughs> oh yeah, by the oh yeah, by the way, uh, the an the Pokemon anime with Ash as the main character is ending already, right? What's gonna happen to Jesse and James? Duck, 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 huh? Who's that? Who is it? Oh, Miss Penny. Ah, Miss Penny, do come in. H Hello, director. Okay, and she, she's here to give her answer. And what would that be? Um, You know the LP I gave you both in exchange for helping me with Operation Star 4? I got hold of it sort of illegally by hacking the Pokemon League's LP management system. Ah, I see. That is quite the revelation. I did not think such a thing was even possible in the first place. If it can be connected to the internet, it can be hacked. <laughs> Did you not know this? It wasn't all that hard. Uh, 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 I mean, I'm really sorry and I won't do it again. Hmm, this matter is rather out of my jurisdiction, I'm, I'm afraid. I will have to consult Miss Gita, the Pokemon egg chairwoman, on how best to proceed. Jiraga holding stone LP. I've even used this black money. To craft some TMs and bankroll a few purchases. <laughs> anyway, I, anyway, I guess I will continue. I, I will continue using the the LP anyway. We just need to keep. We just need to craft more TM. Use finish all the. Yeah, just finish all that. What's that thing? The LP. Is there a way to wash the LP? You know, like, like launder it. Is 
Is it even possible to engage in like LP laundering? Ah, huh? wait, are we are, are we running around around with with Miss Tendra? Yes we are. You ran you ran three laps around the school, yeah. <sighs> that really worked out a nice sweat. You got a good pair of legs on ya, new kid. And then she gives us a sandwich. Miss Dendra's sandwich was dry and had an odd smell. The taste left left much to be desired. Oha raga, oha final. How was it? I hope it was tasty. <laughs> oh yeah, tasty. Sorry, I shouldn't have asked you that, hey. I'm athletic and all, but I don't know the first thing about making good food. As your honest reaction just reminded me. Well, I'll uh, see you later. Enjoy your sore muscles tomorrow. You became slightly closer and missed Andra. Final! And everyone here, did she know you can flirt with the teachers here? You can yeah you can. I'm talking to the teachers in the school and then they are like you just increase your close your closeness with them a little bit a little bit. Final says I will flirt the nurse, I guess. Final. You can flirt with the nurse. Let's go flirt with the nurse right now. We flirted with her twice and now we flirted with her twice and now she has come to the entrance hall to look for us, anticipating our grand entrance. Is this a date? Which corner of the school are we going to? Oh, hey Shiraka! Were you looking for me? I've been away from the nurse's office lately. Did you need something from me? Yes. I have a on her, just a sec. Oh, she actually does heal up your Pokemon. Huh? Oh yeah, I guess it's pretty unusual for me to be out of the nurse's office like this. Well, I'm actually doing a little bit of studying. So I'll try my best at the health teacher certification exam one more time. You can do it. Just so you know, it's totally not because I'm inspired by a certain somebody working hard at their treasure hunt, okay? Well, maybe I am just a little bit. So, you know, uh, thanks. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my break time's almost over. I know you'll be cheering me on, Shiraga. You feel trusted. She is the first uh, school staff member. That we that we saw this dialogue line for. Are you tired? Why not lie down and have a quick rest? On your lap? On your lap? On your lap? Shit. I'm gonna get my I'm gonna get my S band on Twitch. Okay, uh... Are we done with Team Star? Why is she looking for us in the nurse office again? Huh? 
Chiraka, I'm glad you're here. I have some good news. I'm not gonna believe this, but... I passed a health teacher certification exam. Oh my god. Number one, congratulations. But number two, didn't I just talk to you like three minutes ago? Oh, that makes revives. But they tell me there's no room to add new classes this year. So I guess I'll keep being Miss Nurse Miriam for a bit. Just to wait though, I'll be standing in front of the class at the academy before you know it. Then I'll teach you all you need to know about health. You form a close bond with Nurse Miriam. <laughs> of course it has to be the school nurse. Oh hey Shiraka! Don't work too hard out there. Rest is important too. Cafeteria. Oh, this is a sandwich shop. Penny anyway. Okay, anyway, I, I think we are done with the Team Star one. I thought we had to find them, and then I was expecting some text like, like Team Star, like Team Star, half of Stars complete or whatever, but I didn't see. Guess I just head out. We are going to do one last thing. We are going to fight Nemona. The rot to 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 Oh, Shira Oh, the speak of the devil, Penny Penny? There's something I want to talk to you about Would you, would you come meet me in front of the school stairs? You know where we first met I'll be waiting okay, Anyway, let's meet out with Penny Who is at the bottom of the stairs Why is, it, why is it storming in school anyway? Oh, hi Penny. Hasta la vista. The six of us thought up the catchphrase back when we created the team. It's so cringy, it's perfect, you know. Anyway, about the LP thing, I thought I was going down big time for hacking the leg point system, but they're letting me off easy. What happened? The Pokemon League say they'll wave my dad if I do some volunteer engineering for them. They even asked me to come work for them after I graduate, if you can believe that. There's a phrase for this. Keep your friends close. Keep your enemies closer. Director Clavel and the Gita lady kept complimenting me like a weird amount. Apparently I have outstanding talent or something. Sorry for calling you out here to meet like this. I'm still not so great with people face to face. I never seem to find the right words but um... But thank you so much. You saved Team Star and my friends along with it. I know words won't ever be enough to properly thank you for all you've done, so here. Oh my god, Draco Meteor. I'm sure you'll put this to good use. And one more thing. I want to repair, re repair, repay the debt I owe you. If you ever think of a way I can do that, just let me know. I'm good with machines and hacking and stuff. 
So next time I'll be the one helping you, Shigaka. Be seeing you then. Hasta la vista. Why is that person walking by me up the stairs, walking so stiffly and so unnaturally? Ah, there we go. This is what I was looking for. Star Force 3. Complete. Only one thing remains. First, are my Pokemon at max health? Let's take a nice, long, slow walk down the steps. <clears throat> it's time for the battle of the century. You ready for a battle between champions? Cause all these folks sit here seem ready to watch. Work got around, I guess. <clears throat> and out of every single person gathered here, I'm the most excited by a mile. <laughs> it's even the wind. Let's go. You are challenged by champion Nemona. Finally, the thing I've waited all this time for. Time to begin our greatest battle of all. Oh my god, level 65. <laughs> Okay, one down. To think I helped teach you tight matchups and now you're using it to put the hurt on me. Oh, mod. Oh, the recoil hurts. The recoil really hurts. Da dance pass. Go, Flamingo. A da dance pass is just a longer dance pass. If they add another two more segments, it's called a da da dance pass. Close combat. Gudra. This is dragon, right? This is dragon. The three segment rare one, like the mouse hole of mouse hole of three. Wait, there's one in three segments. Is it? I thought it was fixed. There's a there's a shorter one. Oth worm. This is an oth worm. I think this was at least half steel. Close combat.
If my flamingo gets creamed by an attack, I will die. <laughs> my defenses are, are both at minus 3 now. Skelly Dirge. It's all done with this. My last Pokemon. We are going to fight with everything we've got. Actually, right. They all end up having the same effective power, right? In the end. This will be 160 because of super effective. This will be 160. No, this has more power because at the same time I take bonus, yeah. At plus it adds an extra 50%, so 180. So this actually does more. A little, this actually hits a little harder. Imasu yo! Here I go! Goodbye, Flamingo. Get ready to see how strong Skelly Dutch has grown since the day we all met. Ah, wow, 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 wow. Very nice. Very nice. <clears throat> Let's see you try this now in Melon Pan. I like a well baked bread. In my diet. You... You did it! This is legit incredible, you are the strongest out there, Shiraga! I mean, you knocked me flat and I was giving you absolutely everything I had! Everything I... Everything I... <laughs> oh man, both Pokemon battling, am I right? It's so much better, so much more fun than I ever even knew! Thanks for the incredible match, you beat me for real this time. Now let's give ourselves a minute and have a quick break, Shiraga. For round... Uh, uh. Which Pokemon should I bring out this time? Decisions, decisions! Nemona, rest a little, would you? And set, victory road complete. Yo, oven here. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, down boy, don't jump up like that. Seems like hearing your voice as old Marble Steve here all worked up Shiraga. Speak of Marble Steve. You know my sister's doggo. Okay, I'll tell you about, uh, tell you about my sister's doggo later. I've been able to secure two allies who want to go to Area Zero with us. That should have us ready to tackle anything. So now, we've all just got to get there. 
first step will be gathering at area 0. I'll be waiting, ready, ready and waiting at the 0 gate. I'll send you the location on your phone too. Don't leave me hanging forever. Okay, this is the 0 gate. Head to the zero gate. So anyway. Eh? Wait, directors the directs the directors looking for us. <coughs> Hi, Clavel. Thank you for the visit, Master Shiraka. A good friend of mine has been telling me of your recent exploits. A good friend? Haha, <laughs> I'll leave the identity to your imagination. But now, lest I forget, there is another matter I would very much like your opinion on. Do you know what matter manner a gentleman's hairstyle is considered cool as it were among the youth these days? Are you letting Penny's comment get to you? <laughs> Hi! If I select an option, will Clavel change his hairstyle? Will he change his hairstyle accordingly? Is there such a thing? First of all, number one, bow cuts are out. Absolutely not. No, never, refuse. Long locks? What is... What is defined as long locks? I really have no idea. Similarly, I actually I'm actually not good. I'm not good with hair terms. I don't know what's a pompadour. I like bow cut. Huh? No 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 final. I have to disagree with you on that. Disagree. No. Please. There's so much you can do. There's so much you can do with your hair. Go for something else. On others. Ah, okay, okay, fine. Would this change your hairstyle? I don't know. I, I doubt we will, but I would like to think that you would. Oh, is that so? I suppose I've indeed seen some of the academy's male students spotting such a style. Could it be then that the pompadour has already had its day in the sun? Perhaps I ought to consider a change of wig. <gasps> ah, that is to say, uh, never mind. Thank you for your insight, Master Shiraka. It was most enlightening. Oh, he uses a wig. I think that's for his other outer ego. He's probably asking you to evaluate his outer ego's uh wig. You form a close bond with director Clavel. We only you mean we are only forming a close bond right now? Then what then what was a whole song and dance earlier on? What was the whole song and dance early on for this whole game? You can't be tell you can't be telling me that this is actually like like what? Like slave slave trade, right? Oh yeah, and by the way, uh Jack here will ask you to register a certain number of Pokédex entries. He'll give you stuff at 30, 100 and now I need to catch 200. I think when I when I registered 30, he gave me a 4 swipe TM.
<clears throat> okay, let's go to Area Zero. Area Zero. I tried to roll my tongue a little bit and, and the subtitle bot got it wrong. Oh my god, what the fuck was that? Oh, that's the clipping camera. Ah, clear blue skies. Am I famous? They say it's that- someone just said it's that kid. Watashi famous, y'all. What's that? Sorry. Your phone can reveal your past lives to me. My mind, I sense great depths to your past. You must have seen much in lives gone by. I can study your rotom phone to peer into past lives you've lived. I call it rotometry. Care to try? Ah, your past. It drifts before my eyes. I see a life you once lived in. Oh, where is this? This reads your past safe files, right? Kanto? Yes, yes, it's coming to clearer focus in this previous life. You once tracked the grounds of Kanto. I see you and a beloved Pokemon on an adventure in the Kanto region, urging each other onwards with a bow. Let's go! Allow me to fashion for your Rotom ca ca phone a case that befits her memories. And there. You got a Pika V case. If you wish to plumb your memories for more past lives, come speak to me again. Gala? Yes, yes, it's coming to clearer focus in this previous life. You once tread the grounds of... Gala! I see you facing now enormous challenges in the Gala region with equally enormous Dynamax Pokemon at your side. I got a ball guy case. Okay, now next one. Sino. Sino, I see you digging beneath the surface of the Sino region itself and dazzling crowds in super contest shows. Allow me to fashion for your rotom phone the case that befits our memories. <laughs> Man, my past lives. I live lots of lives. I, I live a past life in Hoenn many times over. I also live a past life in like Unova, Carlos. Oh, I got a Poketch poke case. The last one is Hisui. Hisui, I see you braving a great adventure in the Hisui region, an odd phone grip in your hand. Wait, where is Hisui? I never heard of it. Never have I met one who has lived so widely as you. I'm honored to have divined your past. How's the phone look anyway? How do you how do you even show your phone? Yes. You need to equip. Where? How 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 does one equip phone cases? Change your clothes button. Change my clothes or let's go behind let's go to a quieter corner. Uh, bro, I wanted to, like, leave the town. The 
the old Kanto when Lance did not have any weakness other than Dragon. Huh? Weak to Ice what? No? Was, what, 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 wasn't he like super ultra weak to Ice? With Ice Beam or... Red and blue, no ice yet, right? They had ice, they had ice, they had ice. They had, yeah, they had, they had ice. There was seal. Seal, jinx. <laughs> yeah, seal, jinx, uh, yeah. The seal become, okay, seal isn't an ice type, but dugong is an ice type. Water ice. So Dugong, Cloyster. A lot of the water, a lot of the water types could learn. A lot of the water types could learn ice moves also. Uh. <coughs> yeah. The only problem was that like the, the only problem was that like uh one of the. I think I think the the. The dragon, the dragon knight sometimes blast will blast you with thunderbolt also. So that's about the only issue you might run into. I remember one. I remember one dragon knight will blast you with fire blast. One dragon, one of them blast you with thunderbolt. The last one blast you with like, blast you with like this one. I think I was it blizzard or ice beam. I I don't remember. But y'all can consider yourself lucky already. I don't think there was a high-powered dragon move in Gen 1. Last time I remember dragon dragon type dragon moves were a little strange last time. If I remember correctly, the dragon what there was only one what? Uh, there's only dragon rage, which is just a fixed 40 HP. Hey Yoshiraga, God Blast. Hi Rene, God Blast. God Blast everyone. Let's go to area zero. The entrance point is here, but maybe, yeah, we, but I think we should go the zero gate another day. We are getting, it is getting a little late, I have work tomorrow. Shall we go and hit all the raids? Let's go hit some raids, we really need, yeah, let's go hit some raids and farm for like, items. My friend told me there's a... Uh, my friend told me there's this like... Uh, what's, what's there? <coughs> There's a deli bird, I don't know what time it ends. I don't know what I don't know when the the deli bird one ends, but like But I think it should be very soon because my friend told me it's only under it's only 24th and 25th and and well yeah it, we are already in entering 27. I think it is still 25th because of time zone. Need to finish the post game too if if I remember right. Yes, you yeah, you need to. I'll uh, do it tomorrow. I think that's enough. That yeah that, that's enough for today. Like, let's just let's just hit some rates for today. Oh yeah, if any of y'all have like uh what's that ah? Uh? If any of y'all want to join for rates, uh yeah, let's uh I, I don't know how how do you how do you invite people ah? Uh? What's this teleporting? Why are you flying? Come here. I wanna fight you.
Why are you just flying out there? Hello? Moshi Moshi. I give up. <laughs> Go to the Pokemon Center, the yellow part, then you connect internet and tell, tell the code to the other party. Okay. Can I just invite you directly here? <clears throat> three three seven six seems to be the link code. Wait, there's a link code. Y'all try, y'all try. I don't know. How's this work? Eh, you're in offline mode. <laughs> it disappeared. When I went to online mode, it disappeared. Oh my god. Boy, what's this scam? I've never actually played this co op before. Go to the Pokemon Center and let people in, is it? Let me find a glistening red. Now that this red have like glistening icons here, I don't know. Oh, is it because it expired? Is it because time's up? Or the red? Like the, the, the deliberate red? I notice now the reds are glistening anymore. Ah, okay, I'll tell you what, whatever. We, we just... We just hit something. Yeah, let's just hit something. <clears throat> right, I never actually had people in, in town before. How how do I do this? Using the unions <clears throat> Using the union circle, you can play together with your friends as an adventure around Paldia. If you want to leave play in nearby friends, you should leave your internet connection in offline mode. If you want to play with far away friends, change the online mode. You can connect to or disconnect from the internet from within the Poke portal. When you want to invite friends to play together if you form a group and then tell your friends the link code you set. When you want to join your friends group, you'll need to enter the link code they share with you. Remember that you won't be able to take part in link battles, link trades, or terra raid battles with anyone but your fellow group members when you are playing together as a group. So I form a group here. If the trainer who formed the group loses their connection, the whole group will be disbanded. Try your best to play, play in an environment with a strong and steady connection. <clears throat> okay, uh, I have a link code here. H7KT74 Ah, I see one final here. <laughs> if y'all want to play, yeah, uh, I I don't know I don't know what what to do. Uh. I I really am just opening this. Page seven K T seven four. Actually, actually, if I set up now, y'all can still join later, right? Final call. Final call. Cannot join it. Ah. Okay, ah, whatever. <laughs> Scarlet and Violet won't be going away anytime soon. They poof. 
Ja, oh. Welcome. Okay, uh, where to? A red? I see some reds. Do items respawn? This is Finals Crystal. Final, it says it's a crystal. I don't know what, 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 what this means. I mean, you can just join. I'm not... Uh, yeah, you can just join anything. Yeah, jo join whatever. I don't mind. Okay, how's this work? Is this a this is a fortress, right? It's a fortress. Okay, I'm ready. <laughs> Time to get them Terra Terra shots. Yes, I need I need a Terra shots. I need like fifty. <clears throat> ah, okay, never mind. <laughs> Energy has begun to gather around Fortress. Oh my god. That shield is holding very firm. Wait, I should I should not I should not wave I should not wave spinner. Wave spinner will destroy the terrain. Almost there. Zap cannon. Wonderful. Oh, oh, he's down. Port? Go, Fortress! Dun, 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 dun. Wonderful. Oh.
Yeah. <clears throat> okay, I can one more. I'm right, sure. I right, anything. You can just you can just flop anywhere. Ah, okay, there we go. <laughs> hmm? One star. This is it. Oh, it's a masquerade. What's the typing for this? Is this dark time? Change to melon pan. Go melon pan. Already. When it comes to the terror rates, right, I would prefer this terror rate system over the previous one. Over the previous one in Sword and Shield. The Sword and Shield one, uh, if you get. If four Pokemon faint, uh, well, yeah, you get wiped. You get wiped, and you and you have to restart the whole shit over. <coughs> yeah, so in a sense, this is this one just allows you to get, as long as you can mount a, a decent offensive. Yeah, you can. Yeah, 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 more or less set. Sort of resurrection. Yeah, yeah, you just you just you just respawn after five seconds. So in a sense it's a li yeah, it's it's a little faster, yeah. So you you just have a time limit to, to contend with. Energy has begun to gather around Masquerade. Another thing about the about the race in Sword and Shield is this: is that they are artificial like HP gates. So let's say even if you can one shot a Pokemon, uh, a red Pokemon, right? If there's a HP gate, it was it will hard stop at the gate. No matter what. So anything beyond that is basically wasted. And then at this point when it throws up the at this point when you hit the gate, right? It will throw up a shield. And yeah, you need to break the shield. Some of the very difficult raid I think some of the very difficult raid Pokemon have like I saw one with an eight shield bars. Eight shield bars, which means you need to hit it with eight attacks. You need to hit me with 8 attacks, you know, 8 eh, freaking 8, that's like, let's say 4 Pokemon, right, 4, the, every raid party has 4, has 4 Pokemon, that means you need 2 rounds, 2 rounds just to break the shield, you need 2 rounds to break the shield, okay, what else ah, huh? yeah, 2 rounds to break the shield, you must clear the raid in 10 thirds, by the way, 10 rounds, so you are wasting 2 rounds just to break the shield, now you can Dynamax, Dynamax will break two shield bars. But your Dynamax only lasts three turns.
Okay, going off. Okay, switch out battery. Alright, no problem. Thank you. Thank you for joining. How do I disband? How does one disband disband group? Go to the union circle. Oh, okay. Uh, I, I will, I will disband also. Group disbanded. Okay, let's return to single player mode. Dun dun. I'm just thinking if I have done everything that I need. Like, not just in Pokemon, like for... Like work tomorrow. I okay I uploaded everything already. Yes, I uploaded everything. Oh right, okay guys, I tell you something uh, today uh, this afternoon I was doing I was doing some work, clearing clearing off some work. My sister's my sister went out. My sister, brother in law, everyone went out. So it was just me and the doggo. And then for whatever reason the doggo got spooked. By something. So the doggo started pacing around the house. And then while, when I was doing work, it suddenly ran into my room, went under, went like un under my chair, under, through, between my legs, under my legs. And, and then it ran to the distant corner of the room. And then, I, and then I, at this point, I'm just like, I'm just like, oh my god, what Dolly, what are you doing? What are you doing? Why are suddenly running under my leg? You can run behind my chair, but then I think you are running between my legs. I mean, I say this, but it's not like, it's not, it's not like the doggo understands. So he ran under my legs. He ran to the corner of the room. And guess what? Suddenly, I see yellow spreading out from below the doggo. A yellow liquid. I just look at I just look at like I just look at the yellow liquid that's like, spreading it's like it's like oh oh it's time for housework Ah static Does not go like you I don't know I don't know it just occurred to me that maybe I should not have run Ya in here. <clears throat> yeah, so, so anyway. Yeah, let me just return onto the fuel first. Okay, so so I ch I, I I chase a doggo out of the room, and then I I just I, I take a fuck ton of paper, like like kitchen kitchen towers to start soaking up the water. Oh, the sorry, the urine. Yeah. Ah, oh, then after that, I said, oh, I'm gonna time to mop the floor. Yeah, I mop the I I mop the floor. On the plus side, on the plus side, well, I, I guess it was a nice break. Okay, maybe not a nice break. I do, not a nice break. The the 
the doggo's urine had a very foul smell. Yeah, it had a pretty bad. It, it had a pretty bad smell. Not good. Yeah, I don't know why. Like, I thought it, I thought it would be like a little more odorless, but it wasn't. I sh yeah, I, I thought it would be a little more like on the odorless side, but it turns out it's like yeah. There was kind of a pungent smell at it, like it lingering around. Yeah, I mopped the floor. I ran the fan high speed after that to ventilate the room. So anyway, yeah, uh, we just tidy up. Uh, we just we just clean, mop the floor, and then we were yeah. Uh, what what a what a glorious waste of forty minutes. Oh, and the, this doggo, this doggo also chew the front door mat, the mat at the front door. And then, and then just in and then just in time just in time the when I was mopping the floor the mother came out of her room because she was like because she heard a lot of like like commotion outside like me dragging stuff around and all that so she came out it's like what happened? Then, then she came out and asked me it's like how come you are mopping a floor and it's like oh uh <coughs> I was like oh uh yeah the doggo peed in my room and also and also uh what's that what was that. Yeah, by the way, uh, the doggo also chew up the carpet at the front door. So the mother goes like, huh? Why is, why is the carpet chew up? Then she goes outside, and then she, but then she loses the carpet, and then she goes like, I don't know where this brown carpet is from. Then at this, po at this point, I was like, I was just, uh, I, I, I asked her, huh? Don't you stack like one, one door mat on top of the other? That means two, two door mats, because, because we established that Putting just one doormat isn't enough, it may be slippery. So you stack, we put like, we stack at two on top of each other. Cause one of them is anti sleep and the other isn't. Yeah, so, so. So, so the mother says, no, I really, I, we, I really never, I really never like, did this. I really never don't recognize this door man. Then then but then after that the after that we took a cloak. After that the mother was just like, oh the right, it's the one outside the house, outside the front door. Which means you know what? Somehow the door go managed to reach out from the front door, reach out, reach out of the door, put the mat in, put the front the door mat outside the the the, the house in. Chew that shit up. Yeah. That's what happened. Have you tried befriending Doggo? Uh. Uh. How should I put this? I seek not the friendship of canines. <laughs> yep. I seek not the friendship of canines. I seek instead the friendship of burp. Oh, and of course. And of course cats. Yes, of course cats. Burp. Yeah, burp. By the way, I saw one T I saw one one TCG, like some kind of like card game ish. Like some kind of card game on on, on this uh on Steam. It was like it's like something like a TCG game. But it's all birds. I'm I I am very Tempted to get it, eh? <laughs> I'm very, very tempted. Oh, it looks, it, it looks so cute. Okay, anyway, go Watson.
I will be hearing this song a lot. I am hearing that there is a 7 star raid coming soon on, on its way. 7 star raid. This time around for Cinderace. I am trying to avoid using Discharge because Discharge will hit everyone, I think. Keyboard. What? Da -da -da -da. <clears throat> nice, we got some Terra shots. I will hit a couple more of the <coughs> of the raids and then I will go and sleep. I think I'll go and sleep. Tomorrow is a work day. I need to haul my ass to the office again. I need to haul my set I'm reeling ass to the office. Out of bed. I need to leave I need to leave uh, my the comfort of my bed and my blanket behind. Stop. I last uh, uh, a while back I bought a I bought a new uh, like a new blanket but I, I only got around to to washing it and actually getting to use it recently like last weekend I can blanket review uh, here's a review of the blanket that I bought the other day at an atrium sale sometime back I bought it at an atrium sale at Serangoon next. It was like buy two discounted price. I can't remember how much, but like, like I think it was like below. I think it was under thirty, under thirty, or under forty. I don't remember, but it was it was really it was really cheap. For a blanket, I, I thought it was really cheap. <coughs> yeah. So so anyway, uh, it, it's a little small, but it, it's a little small. It's kind of thin, but it is surprisingly really warm because it's like fleece or something. It's like fleece. So it's really, it's really like sick. Or should I say, it's, it, it traps heat really well. But sometimes, but I, I must say this, sometimes blanket, right? Sometimes the blanket, if, if, it feels a little better to have a, a, a sick one. Something sick rather than something that, that traps heat, but it's very thin. You know, thin blanket sometimes feel like, sometimes feel like, you know, like, it doesn't get a job done. Like sometimes, sometimes you just feel more satisfying to be wrap, to to like to to wrap yourself up in a thick blanket, you know, rather than a thin one. <laughs> like this one is so thin, I I can I can even use it. At, this one is very thin and very light. It's. But the the material just traps it really well though, so so I have like I have U UCS. I yeah I, I sometimes just I I just I can just body it up and use it as like a cushion or something also. Versatile, <laughs> but overall may not be so satisfying to 
yeah, may not be so satisfying to wrap yourself in because it's a little small and it, and it's quite in and, and it's quite thin. Yeah, blanket reviews with Shiraka. Ah, oh, critical catch, critical catch. Ah, item. This is a uh, lava star, right? It's a fighting terror type lava star. Change of Pokemon. Fighting lava star. Fighting lava star. Go Flamingo. Okay, let's go and oh my god. Wow this will hurt me. This recoil gonna hurt me. How much HP does this have ah? Uh? Why why does it seem like why does it seem like Recoil moves against a uh, against this like against a uh, Terra Pokemon does so much recoil. How much recoil damage is the usual anyway? One third. One third. Is it one third or is it half? Usually it's one third right? unless you increase the recoil damage for, for like for like moves. For the moves overall. other rates I feel like I clean out quite a few although there's still a lot left on the map there's a magic cup upgrade here there's a magic cup upgrade Let's see. Oh, 
how do outbreaks work again, right? If if you if you chain multiple, you might get a shiny, is it? I'll say how it work. <coughs> Let's go to the river. Whoa, you found a mess outbreak of wild magic card. Hi, how do I get the magic cup to surface? They are like all swimming underwater. Shiny, 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 shiny. Koi King's gone. Where? Magic Cup's Japanese name apparently is called like Koi King or something. Have you ever played a, an old phone game called Magic Cup Jump before? You basically train your Magic Cup to like uh to like jump, be the best jumper ever. I had to stomp, like to like, jump and, and then land in the water to, to like dive deep enough to catch, to land this magic card. Switch.
How many magic cards do I need to feed? Ah. <laughs> Oh, this was shiny. Is it really worth it? This is like rolling Genshin Gacha and praying for 5 star. I was googling on the site. It says I need to feign at least at a minimum 20 to start seeing. Sorry, to, to feign a minimum of like 30. To start seeing, like. To start seeing the, the benefits. Plush. Magic cup, magic cup. Ah, the poor magic cup never knew what hit them. <laughs> Why is this dude swimming around, attacking everyone? Almost at twenty already. Switch. Ah, <laughs> vote switch out PP. Go discharge. Where I get where I see a gold fish, where I see a golden fish today. You can iron a time though, it's eleven twenty four, okay. The number of magic cup in the outbreak is starting to go down. It's going down because I'm overfishing. Why 
what they aren't showing you are the number of fainted magic card floating on the water surface. What a child friendly game. Hiding the reality from you. That you're living in your path. Nothing but the bodies of a uh, unconscious magic card. the auto battling but the thing is the, the auto battling doesn't reach doesn't reach the the magic cup in the water i think we try okay we try this Magic cup. Go. Let's go. Yeah, where are you going? Okay. Any? Any more? Any more? Oh, here, there we go. There's more here. I would like to strike some gold if you don't mind. How many have I? How, how many have I hit already? Anyway, when I was checking, when I was checking online for some for some information, apparently there's a limit to the mess up break also. This doesn't last forever, like the for like the entire day. After a while, it will uh, it will eventually taper off. There's a tutor, that's not a magic cup.
How'd you cut? I will deplete this mess outbreak before I even like <laughs> land a shiny. It would be cool to actually if you actually manage to roll and get a shiny magic cup in here, you know, on this very moment. There are not many magic cards left from the original outbreak. I'm depopulating it. I am severely depopulating this outbreak. Have a pity ray, game freak. Do the shinies have a pity ray? Like you know, like the very last one of the outbreak is guaranteed to be a shiny. That kind of thing. Please, please. I already lost count at this point. No safety net. Yeah, there isn't. On the plus side, at least we're spending money. To I'm telling you, if you if you had to spend money, you better be a safety net. Okay. I don't understand how people can will like stuff like say like FGO. I heard FGO is. I heard FGO makes Genshin look like charity. I don't understand really. But people actually actually people will just spend like 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 what thousands? Thousands upon thousands? And and still not get what they want by the way. The Pokemon from the outbreak have dispersed. Shimata. No shiny. Oh well, it is what it is.
Okay, any, everyone, since I have wrapped up all I needed to do, I will go and I'll head off for the night. I Yeah, I'll head off for the night. Let me just stop over at some Pokemon Center or something. Our next stop is Area Zero. I will continue tomorrow night. Tomorrow night, my dinner appointment got cancelled. It got shifted to another day. So tomorrow night, we are heading into Area Zero. Yep. So I think we can stop over at Medali. Otsu, thank you for sure. No problem. Hey, y if y'all are going back to work tomorrow, have a good day at work, okay? Have a good day at work. Uh, don't <laughs> sleep early. Don't oversleep. I know for sure I'm going to fucking oversleep tomorrow. So I'm going to try to sleep early to, to avoid that happening. I'm going to walk into the office with breakfast and have a nice breakfast. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> hey, let me just stretch a little bit. Yeah, let me just stretch a little bit. <clears throat> okay. I will be heading off for the night. Please have a good one. Okay, have a good night. God bless all. See you all tomorrow night, same time, 2 p.m. Let's uh, 2 p.m. 9 p.m. Why did I say 2 p.m.? 9 p.m. Yeah, so there we go. Yeah, I will send you all to one more channel to end off the night also. With that, I will wrap up here. Thank you. Good night. Bring more water across the road carefully. Play less computer. Brush your teeth thoroughly. Yeah. Oh yeah, Sumi. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow at 9pm. Same time. Area 0.